Right. Where were we? Oh, yeah. It was the first day, and I was deciding on which employees I was going to hire, besides the one that was already there. Let's see. Already there was Reno. Next I heard two others. Joy. And let's see, Delaney, yeah. Well, I had to start somewhere. And about this abnormality. Nothing was well, that's why I sent Reno to find out what this abnormality was, what it was motivated by. Had him start with instincts. Which this abnormality didn't seem to like. So I'd best not use that again. So I sent. Joy to do an attachment work, see if that was well received. And this work was much better received than instincts. Although, not by a lot. Although I was wondering if it was because of who was working with this abnormality. So I decided to try it again with Delaney. No, no, that's not right. It was with Reno again. After who's I had Delaney on standby for the next research work. Hmm. I'm guessing, or rather, I was guessing. is because they were unfamiliar with this abnormality. Which is alright. We were as well. Oh, so that's what it was called. That's what I was thinking. One sin and hundreds of good deeds. And it turned out that insight and attachment were best to use. So I decided to send Delaney in to do an inside work. And since a grip off meltdown was imminent, I decided to send someone in to deal with that once Delaney was finished. Because I do not want one sin and hundreds of good deeds to start causing trouble to the facility. It'll be good practice for later. Now we have the energy quota. But I'm not gonna settle for that. Or rather, I wasn't gonna settle for that. Sorry, got the terms wrong. As has already happened. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah. After that, I kept repeating. Systematically sending in employees to do research, gain PE boxes, and also to unlock everything that we can. Because we'll need that equipment, that ego suit, and that ego weapon. As the suit that we have on our agents already, and their riot sticks, that's only gonna go so far. Especially if up against an abnormality that's strong against red damage. Against that, riot sticks would be useless. And it'd be nice to have some protection against black damage, as that eats away at both health points and sanity points. Well, I was getting an idea of how things were working around here. And it turned out that the agents were figuring out how to do better research. I decided that it's best to get all the research done and also get all the equipment from this abnormality. Sooner rather than later.
Yeah, I know it might sound like I've been doing something tedious or wasting time, but it's called planning ahead, okay? I had a feeling that I need you to get that equipment for the agents before things became more complicated.
Yeah, I know it was debatable whether or not I made the right decision that day. But I need one thing. The decisions made on that day would help determine what happened from that point onwards. <sighs> one decision can make a difference between success and failure. Saving lives and destroying them. <sighs> it's not a responsibility that you thrust into anyone's hands. <sighs> well, it was a decision that was thrust into my hands. <sighs> Sorry, no arguments for me there. <sighs> yeah, I was thinking about what happened after, but that can wait. We're talking about what happened on day one. It was mostly uneventful. Just routine stuff. Planning ahead for later. Preventing quite off meltdowns. That sort of thing. My management report for day one. Hmm. Sounded quite satisfactory. Not bad for a first day. It was the next day that I found out about the motto of La Balmy Corporation, and also the founder of it. Hmm, A. That sounds mysterious. I told her the truth about which part I preferred, facing the fear. As that's what you do with fear, isn't it? Yeah, and she seemed to have some brief confusion there. 
briefly thinking that she was human. Before correcting herself. Then she talks about pioneering a whole new world, along with some other stuff. Let's just say that I wasn't interested in all this sales talk. I was just interested in doing my job. Although she did say that we barely noticed their presence until now. And their fears because, well, we don't really understand them. Frighteningly alien. Well, I'm sure some of them really are alien. How's then? given clarification about what happened the previous day before I started my job proper. Specifically what happens when an employee resigns. Let's just say it's not the conventional leaving your job. Something which you should have explained previously. Which you did then. Comparing this organization to a well-oiled machine and that she compared, well, to put it in blunt terms, the people work here as the cogs in this machine, and that they need to be replaced when they wear out. Preferably before it grinds to a halt. They imply that, well, they're disposed of. Then Malkov appeared. Happy that I did what she asked me to do. It would seem that her optimism, in my case, was rewarded. Although she did have her concerns. Yeah, that was when it was confirmed that it is possible to die here. And apparently a good job is when no one dies. Well, they weren't perfect, because they weren't human. Hmm. And I found out that abnormalities are only one thing to worry about. Which somehow unnerved Malkov. And I agreed with her that the unknown could not... <sighs> yeah, sorry. It can't be controlled. Although she wasn't convincing about when she said that she wasn't afraid. Hmm. 
Yeah, I had my concerns about her, but I decided to put them aside for now, as she gave me a new mission. To have four works that are either good or higher. Malkoth gave me three research proposals. One that sped up time, one that allowed command between departments, and even the ability to call all agents within a department back to the main room. Yeah. Like many things around here, I need to choose wisely. The assembly summons it was. Right, I got a new abnormality. To have some research done. I also decided to hire someone new. Ray was joining Reno, joined Delaney. Reno had some prudence training implanted in him. As for Joy, I gave her some more fortitude. Yeah. After that, I decided that my agents needed to be better equipped. So I gave some the spear derived from one sin and hundreds of good deeds. And the others had the right sticks. Best to have a mix of different damage types. Although with all of them, I decided to equip or rather have them equip the suits that I had made for them as they were better than the standard issue ones yeah, if it's better they should use it right on to day two Now this one was slightly more complicated than day one, but it was doable. As I'm gonna tell you. 